Bruce Belk's Van Game. <laughs> it's a ridiculous idea for his stream. Uh, what do we got here? We got play, options, high scores, and quit. Let's go to options. I'm always an option guy. Master volume, music volume, sound effects, click volume. I don't know. I don't know who this dude is. Uh, I don't want full... Oh, I did not want that. Thank you. Um tutorials left right toggle i don't know things are working okay so far no need to change any of that here we go <laughs> with a ridiculous idea for a stream it is the van game uh new game Ooh, our first option we've got the machine of mystery Less chance of injury. Encounter more stranded vehicles. Less reliable engine. That sounds a lot like my van. Uh, in the middle, we've got the Hippy Dippy. This is obviously the um, Volkswagen van. Task rewards increased, probably, if that thing's still running. Uh, encounter more police. Yeah, if there's smoke coming out the windows, I think they're going to know what we're doing in there. And less chance to find free stuff. I don't know why that would be. I feel like eh, in a Volkswagen van, you would be looking for free stuff on the side of the road. Uh, and then on the third one, we've got the runner. Of course, that is the Ford uh, Transit, the big, uh, tall, tall, high top vans, as they say, which I would love to have, uh, but uh, cannot afford on my first uh, van life project. Uh, gas prices are cheaper. That's odd. I would think. I guess it gets good mileage. Uh, encounter more traffic jams, and upgrades are more expensive. All right. I feel like I should probably go with the mystery machine, just because that looks the most like my van. Um, but if anybody has a hard preference one way or the other, now's the time to uh, to air it. All right, we'll go with the mystery machine here. Um, okay, let's see. We've got some money. We got some food. I guess this is a... Oh, okay. So these are our attributes, more or less. Uh, first aid, zero. That's good. Tires, zero. And toolkits, zero. And we're going to choose some characters. So, um, thank you, Adam, for that. <laughs> thank you, Adam. Uh, let's see. Uh, how many points do I get to apply to things? Okay, I get eight clicks. I get eight, eight points. Yeah, I'm going to say a um, couple toolkits. Couple tires, couple first aid. That gives me two more. I'm gonna maybe some money. Yeah, I'm gonna click easy because that's oh, and I get ten. I see. So that so how about this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That seems reasonable. Uh, starting point. Oh, do we want to go west to east or start on the west or do we want to go east? Uh, I will start in the west. Um, we got Ra Rowan, Jamie, Kelly, Tyler, Cameron, and the Discovery Wanderer. Uh, I don't know how many people. Yeah, that does. I think that's a good point. Yeah, but the food's at a hundred. See, so, so I think that's a lot of food. I want to get somebody that doesn't eat a lot of food. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go with um, Jamie. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, these are uh, all people. Oh, okay, so we can switch these people out. Uh, give Jamie some nerd glasses there. That seems... Oh, I see. We could just change these people a little bit. Uh, can this... Uh, oh, and this scrolls around. Uh... This looks like a van life guy. <laughs> this is this is uh, not a group of people I would want to get in their van so far. Uh, this is a nice van life. Oh, oh, I got rid of mine. This looks like Velma. We're going to put Velma here. Well, now I've kind of whitewashed my group here. Um, I'll leave this guy here. Um, what else have we got here? Um, I do kind of like, I feel bad if there's only one. Oh, this is, is that a girl? Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm putting this dude back in. <laughs> like that guy. I feel like this guy knows some stuff. Like if somebody knows how to start a fire with some sticks, um, or build a shelter out of flannel, it's this guy, this guy can uh figure out the electronics this looks like a navigation kind of lady she probably knows where to go uh she looks pretty smart it might just be the glasses i don't know i think this is a good crew all right we're hitting the road we're hitting the road oh close character screen great I want to start in the west. Oh, done. There we go. <laughs> All right. The year is 2021. There are no lockdowns. There's no pandemic. It's summer and time to go on a road trip with your friends. The destination, as many national parks as you can, before you all get tired of driving. It should say before you all get tired of each other. Because five people in a van, I don't feel like that's going to uh, gonna go very well. Uh, hop in your van and hit the road. Let's go. All right. And there we are. Am I? Uh... So I think this is very Oregon Trail. This is, oh, here we go. Uh, you see a bag lying on the side of the road. Do you investigate? I feel like you got to. Don't you got it? I would stop if I saw a bag. I mean, is there a leg sticking out of the bag? Like, it doesn't really say. Is the bag like the size of a bag that might have money? Or it might have a body? <laughs> uh, I know. I'm going to get dysentery from this bag. I'm trying it. I'm trying it. Uh, you found $37. All right. The okay is correct. All right. We're on the way. Here we go. This is what van life, this is what it, exactly how I imagined van life. Just driving around with four of your pals and finding money on the road. I think that's really the van life dream. I think that's how it works. Uh, you spend an hour driving around lost. That is not surprising. Although I would feel like uh, at least three of those people down there would have GPSs. <laughs> I think four of those people have a GPS and one of those guys would be able to find the direction based on, uh, where the sun is in the sky. I'm not naming who's who. Uh, oh no. All right. We got to get to a national park, yo. Cameron has broken an arm. <laughs> Oh, no, Cameron, what were you doing? <laughs> no, uh, you have two first aid. Oh, <laughs> suffer, Cameron. <laughs> what was he doing in the van? It's not like they were playing racket ball. <laughs> I mean, I'm hoping he was sitting in his seat with his seatbelt on and he was just like, 
Oh, my arm broke. Cameron, what are you doing in the back seat? I don't know. My arm just broke. <laughs> um, exactly. He's like, he's like trying to get high fives from truckers. I feel like, um, like it's almost if it was his fault, I might should let him suffer. But uh, yeah, exactly. This ain't Teen Wolf. Uh, all right, I'll use the first aid. Oh, look, I took off. Whoa. All right, tutorial. Rest to heal your characters, complete tasks for resources, and trade for random supplies. Disable all the tutorials. I don't want to disable all the tutorials. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, so rest will heal our characters. Um, not going to mention any names, but one of them has a broken arm. One of them broke their arm from riding in the car. Complete tasks for resources and trade for random supplies. We got to get us, um, what supplies do we need in the van? We're going to need, um, some battery powered puck lights. Everybody has those. We're going to need a 12 volt, uh, or USB powered fan. Uh, what else do I see in all the van videos? Bottles of water. Going to need some water. Some uh, protein bars. Okay, that gives us some ideas. Um, but yes, you have to have the buddy heater and, and little things of propane. So uh, let's get old Cameron rested up. How long will you rest? Eight hours. One level of comfort. I mean, eight hours. I mean, four of them should be sleeping while one's driving. So eight hours ought to be plenty. It's ridiculous. Music is very chill. Uh, as downloadable content, this game was $5. And downloadable content, you can also get the soundtrack for another $5, which I did not purchase. Um, but uh, I'm kind of kind of digging it. That's true. We got to have our poop bucket. Uh, okay, we already rested. Let's go on a task. Complete task to earn money and sometimes items. Some tasks can be failed, giving only half the usual award. But I feel like half is still better than what we had. The bumper game. Bounce your opponents off the arena. Oh, hey, now. But try not to fall in. Last van standing wins. And we could win a repair kit? And get a color? Okay. Smash games. Smash through obstacles. And do some quick maths to get the most points. This is a math-based challenge. The spiral game. Race up the hill and collect the points. But don't get squashed. All right. Let's try the math one first here. Race along the beach, collecting as many points as you can. The blue diamonds will give you more points. The red blocks will take points away. All I see are red blocks. Oh, you got to go to the red block with the lowest number. I see. Don't panic if you get off to a bad start. <laughs> Thank you, game. Because that's what I see. Let's go see if I'm driving with a mouse here. No, I'm not driving with a mouse. How am I driving? Oh, there you go. You got to drag your car. Okay, that was bad. That was good. Okay, we're hitting a four. Uh, what's a low? That's not too low. That's some diamonds. I missed it. There's a thing. There's a four. There's a six. Uh, there's a diamond over there. Uh, five, seven. Oh, okay. This is a more math. Also, I don't see it. Oops. A uh, huge difference between a lot of the numbers. I mean, what's the difference between hitting 22 and 23? You know what I mean? All right. That was kind of that was kind of fun. That's my level of game, which is like a game for six-year-olds. <laughs> yes, that's a, <laughs> that's a good point. Okay. Uh, what did we get? It was a smash game. Smash through obstacles. 47 points first equals $94. You did it, it says. That is just like van life. What other tasks do we have? Okay, I already 
Can I do it again? No, I can't do it again. Okay. The bumper game. Bounce your opponents off the arena, but try not to fall in. Um, I don't know. I've be the last car in the arena and how do I just drag my van around with the mouse? Okay, so this is PUBG, I guess, with, with vans. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, no, I'm Shiba. Okay. Oh, go. Oh. No, 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 don't go that. No, no, no. <coughs> but I still got 50%. I got $50 for driving off a cliff. I would do that in real life. Uh, new customization. Go to the garage to use it on your van. All right, we got some sweet paint. Yeah, I feel like uh, there's four four too many people in this van, to be honest with you. All right. New Taz. Okay, we can't do that. Okay, so, but now we got um, race up the hill and collect the points, but don't get squashed. How would I get squashed? Oh, my Lord. Oh, no. Well, here we go. Oh, now I'm on the other side of the road. Oh, oh, look out. Okay, go far side. Far, oh. Oh, oh. Get on your side of the road. Oh, bro, no. Oh, it's Indiana Jones boulder. Okay. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Oh, there's a log. Oh, it's a log. Uh, oh, a log. A log. My mouse is so far off my mouse pad. My, my mouse is like eight feet away from where it's supposed to be. Oh, there's a boulder. Oh, oh, God. Oh, oh, oh. There's a boulder. That is a fish light, fish light, fish light. Oh, my God. I'm not cut out for this van life. Aaron, this is the van game. This is my dream. I don't have to build a van. I don't got to do van life. They made a game about van life. <coughs> oh, my God. All right. Uh, I think this is really um, an updated version of uh, Oregon Trail, but uh, with van life. Uh, this is a game that was on Steam for $5. My mouse is supposed to go, like, right here. I can't see it, but like right here, my mouse is like there. <laughs> that was crazy. Oh, oh. You've unlocked a new customization. Go to the garage. Look at that. We got some more paint. If I want to paint my, let's paint this van paint. We'll get this party started. Uh, I'm going to have to go to the garage here. And, uh, oh, what have I got here? We've got engine upgrades. Oh, Okay. Food upgrades, boo. There's a storage thing. Supply, gas, rest. But I, where's my, can I drag this stuff? No, I can't. Oh, I just, oh. Where's my paint? Oh, can I just click? This is like the Hot Wheel. Oh, repair engine. Oh, here we go, colors. Yeah, where's that sweet pink paint I got? That's the color it is now. Didn't I unlock one? Yeah, there it is. Look at that baby now. Yes. What else we got here? Got any decals? Oh, I want to get that decal. I want that Longhorn decal. Look at that. Is that the Illuminati decal? <laughs> I don't know what that is. <clears throat> oh, look, the mystery machine right there. Well, their version of it. Upgrades? Oh, okay, what do we got? Upgrade available food. How much money do I have? Oh, this, uh, let me just click on something. Um, here we go. 400 food storage. It costs $200 and my cash is $348. Okay, yeah, let's, why not? Let's buy that. All right, let's go to the shop. Oh, what do we got here? Buy food, supplies, and refuel. <clears throat> uh, I'm going to need some food because Cameron ate all the food when he broke his arm already. 
Oh, I have no first aid. Um. Oh, okay. Cameron used, uh, Aaron, you missed it, but uh, one of the passengers of the van somehow magically broke his arm. <clears throat> uh, can I not buy these things? I want to beep, beep, boop, boop, boop. Uh, I don't. Uh... Oh, here we go. Buy food. One food equals one dollar. Okay, so I don't want to spend all my money on food, but I would like some tasty noms. How about 30? Buy. Supply shop. There we go. Uh, first aid. Yay, yay, yay. I'm spending my money. I got toolkits. I got tire. I got three out of four tires. How many do you need? <clears throat> and um, probably need to get some gas. All right. Let's head back to town. Uh, is there any other tasks? Nope. I did all the tasks. This is literally just like uh, real life. Oh, trade. What can we trade? No one wants to trade with you. Well, who can blame them? I got three tires and a broken arm. <laughs> I don't feel like... Yeah, that was a good deal for tires. Uh, okay, we did the town. We did the shop. We went to the garage. Let's hit the road in our sweet pink van. Click and drag to move. Use the scroll wheel to zoom. Click the highlighted locations to travel. Wow. Oh, we're in Portland, and look, there's Seattle right there. Let's zoom in here. When I went to school in Olympia... Yeah, let's get rid of Cameron's arm. Okay, let's go to Seattle. Yes. Oh, it's nighttime. All right. <laughs> Uh, what do we got? There is a heavy fog forcing you to slow down. Oh, no! It, look, it's a heavy fog with special effects. This game's got it all, baby. Uh, Kelly got to rant about something they hate, and everyone agreed. This is Kelly. What was this guy ranting about? He's like, these kids... And their Nintendos. Why don't they play the license plate game like I used to play? I don't think he talks like that. He talks like this. Why don't everybody want to play the license plate game? <laughs> it's like a um, uh, Napoleon Dynamite's uh, brother. <laughs> Gas is leaking out of the fuel. Now, this is real uh, van life. This is exactly my van. Uh, you can use a tool kit to repair it or lose some fuel. Oh boy. Yeah. Kip <laughs> Napoleon. Why did you break your arm in the van? Cause it felt freaking felt like it. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll use a tool kit. My van's kind of a pink turd. Oh, look, it's daylight. Rowan really needs to use the restroom. Well, if we'd have followed Adam's advice and got a poop bucket, we wouldn't have to pull over, would we, Rowan? He loses comfort. Hold it. Hold it, Rowan. Uh, this van is, is in better shape on this game than uh, my van. <laughs> Gas leaks, bladder leaks. I guess we're going to have to go... Rest uh, Rowan. Let's get Rowan some rest. Uh, are you sick of your old van color? 
Want to try something new? Try a sample of our brand new van. Why would I say thank you so much? Oh, that's a nice looking purple. That's a nice looking purple. <clears throat> I feel like if the popo are on our tail, I might need to change the color of the van frequently. Um, let's see. Let's see what we got here on our tasks. Actually, I don't even want to do the tasks in this pink van. Give me that purple, yo. Where is that beautiful purple? Oh, yeah. I still want a decal. Uh, decal. They're all locked. I got money, yo. What could be more uh, not suspicious than a purple, plum purple van with a biohazard sticker on the side? Oh, uh, repair engine. What's wrong with my engine? I'm not repairing that engine. That thing runs like a top. Don't get me started. I'm not repairing no engine. All right. And back to town because I got to earn some money, baby. Draw your own wheels and race. Draw new wheels if you get stuck. What does that mean? 90 bucks, though. I really need it. I really need some. I need 90 bucks. All right. What am I going to do here? Oh, my God. Draw your wheels in the box on the right and watch your van struggle. <laughs> if you get stuck, try drawing new wheels. Your wheels centered in the middle of the line you draw. All right. Oh, I guess it could, it should be like, get up there. That should be like a, I want like a, a spiky, like a ninja star wheel. Yeah, look at that. Get up there. Get up there. That should work. All right, how about this? Oh, I ran out of time. Well, it turns out I'm not a, what's that guy's name? Foos? I'm not a, uh, I'm not a wheel designer. Man, my wheels did not go round and round. My wheels went off the chart. I thought that was a good, look at that wheel. Wouldn't you buy a wheel that looked like that? Huh. <sighs> Draw your own wheels. So what do I get? I get half the money. Thank God I got my wheels back. What else we got here? <clears throat> Use your mechanic skills. <laughs> I Hopefully they're better than my wheel designing skills. To score big, you get three tries, and you're going to need them. <sighs> and I win a new color. I just painted my van. I don't want this peach color. I got a sweet purple van. Okay, what am I doing here? Line up the line with the dot and tap the screen. Tap the screen? Okay. Oh, maybe this is supposed to be like a touch screen game? Uh, the line will move faster every time you click. You have three tries to score as many points. So I've got to click it right when it lines up. Uh, where am I supposed to go? On the line on the side? Is that what it's talking about? Line up the line with the dot and tap the screen. Okay. Oh, geez. Oh, nope. Didn't go so well. This is just like that.
I got some first aid. Gonna need it. Oh, I unlocked that sweet peach color that I just literally painted over. By the way, my van now has four colors of four uh, layers of paint. We're gonna go uh, one more round, and then we're gonna take a break because uh, I contacted two very famous, very large companies for sponsorship on this show, and they sent me a product, and we're gonna enjoy that product in just a few moments. It's gonna be a super surprise. So let's get back. Uh, oops, clicked on my uh, chat window, which was uh, stupid because when I click off, the game pauses. So let's keep that going. Let's see if there's anybody who wants to trade. Uh, nope, nobody here wants to trade a sweet stuff. There's no more tasks for us to do in this town. I'm <clears throat> not resting. Let's take a look in the shop. Got some money. I am almost out of food. Oh my gosh. I let the food get down. I'm going to have to buy like a hundred food. I only got a little money left. Better get some fuel. Can't, oh, I can fill up. And just like the dirty van bums we are, we got $1.38 in our pockets. You know what that means? It's time to hit the road, ladies and gentlemen. Seattle, you've been good to us. But we are on to the next round of National Parks, which I believe is Glacier. Glacier National Park, which I've never been to in real life, I don't believe. Have been to Seattle. I have been to Portland. I would, I could use an RV. I'm in a broken down purple van with uh, bad star shaped wheels. <laughs> I got my wheels back. Jamie and Kelly are trying to figure out <clears throat> which came first, the chicken or the egg. Minus 40. Oh, my. They're arguing this guy's a problem. And let me tell you, not saying she looks like a chicken. This guy's an egghead. So I don't. Kelly might get left at the next stop. Just saying. Oh, I see. I can choose which one. You know what? Too bad, Kelly. Kelly has done nothing for us. Your dad loves Glacier uh, National Park? I've, I've never been. You hit a large pothole. Of course I did. And the repair kit. Fly, I lost a repair kit? That's exactly what my van needed. You see a car stopped on the side of the road. Do you stop to help? I mean, I feel like I'm stopping, but not really to help. It's in hopes that I'm going to lose this bald dude. I got a flat tire and I don't know what to do. Do I give it first aid? Should I use engine repair? Oh, boy. What do I get out of this? You really saved my butt. I can't thank you enough. You could, though. Uh, but maybe you can take this. Kai offers you $61. All right. Which I think is more money than the tire cost me. Yeah, I'm getting ready to start murdering people in my van. Uh, you have a pop tire. <laughs> maybe I hit what that guy hit. I guess I'll replace the tire. Actually, in real life, I would call AAA and I would sleep in my van. Yes. Yes, it is, Aaron. The guy that broke his arm almost died of dysentery. Uh, you see a box lying on the side of the road. What's in the box? <laughs> What's in the box? No way. I found $32 in a box. I'm telling you this. In real life, starting tomorrow, any box or bag I see on the side of the road, I am stopping and searching for money. <clears throat> uh, no hunting for food yet. Let's just say that. No kidding. 
Callie can't find a reason to live. Oh, no, she can't find a reason to smile and has caught the blues. First aid will make him feel... What's in this first aid? Crack? Suffer, Kelly. Nobody likes you. Look at him and look at his health going down. Oh, boy, oh, boy. <clears throat> yeah, it's a Prozac. Oh, Glacier National, National Park. We've made it here. Look at this. Located in the state of Montana, Glacier National Park encompasses over 1 million acres or 1,584 square miles of rugged mountain landscape and glacier-cut valleys. Look at that. This is like an educational thing here. Hey, when I get the van up there, me and Luke are going camping, and there ain't no electronics. He can't bring his Nintendo Switch. There ain't no phones. It's just out there roughing it. Although, and I will, in full defense, the guy, I mean, in the first two seconds of this game, one of the guys broke his arm in my van, so <laughs> maybe maybe he might not want to go camping with me. Um, we got clothes, contents. Oh, there's more pay. I can read more about the state park. I can read a lot about the state park. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Oh, all, <laughs> all money goes to this van. <laughs> so any bits that come in, I'm going right into this van. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Um, I mean, rest. Don't I got a guy that's a bald guy that's crying? He's just crying. He don't want to be on this trip. Um, can I? How long can they sleep? Sleep forever. <laughs> Why would they rest for 16 hours? All right, fine, whatever. Let's see how my dude Kelly does. Come on, Kelly. Kelly's case of the blues has self-healed. Good job, Kelly. Kelly, all we got to do is we got to look and we got to say, I'm good enough. I'm smart enough. And doggone it. People like me, Kelly. How long will you rest? We already rested. Quit your belly inking, Kelly. Um, we got stuff to do. A quiz! Oh, God. Oh, no. This I hope this quiz is about that book I just didn't read. It is. <laughs> Check your passport book before you start. You can only attempt this quiz every 24 hours. Answer three out of four correct to earn 100. I need this money. I need this food. I need this first aid. I need gallons of gas. I need you all. You guys got to come come through uh, for me on this because I did not. Oh, I can check my passport. Oh, who cares? I'm not reading all that. Okay. Oh, go back to the quiz. All right. Start the quiz. I'm pretty good at guessing on um, multiple choice. Who visited the glacier area in 1885 and worked to make it a national park? Was it? Mary Rather Lewis, William Logan, William Taft, or George Grinnell? Yeah, that's true. I want my $4 back. This dude was walkering. Um, I'm open for suggestions. I feel like uh, Lewis might be like Lewis and Clark. Uh, Taft was a uh, president. <laughs> All right. Oh, no. <laughs> it was not. See, how many glaciers were originally in Glacier National Park? Oh, boy. Probably, in retrospect, should have read that book. Ay, ay, ay. 
Yeah, I mean, there had to be one, for starters. Also, I feel like about 30 and less than 100 could be the same answer. And over 150 and over 300 could be the same answer. Oh. About 30. I just want to drive this van. I don't want to quiz. What Native American tribe lives in a reservation next to Glacier National Park? Uh, Blackfeet? Huh. I mean, I've heard of Cheyenne. I've heard of Cherokee. Cheyenne isn't that? Yeah, Cheyenne. Nope. <laughs> and um, how many waterfalls exist in Glacier National Park? I don't know. You know why I don't know? Because... I don't go chasing waterfalls. I got it. I got it. Over 200. All I needed was some TLC humor. Uh, better luck next time. Uh, you got one. And uh, study hard. Wait 24 hours. Probably not. Uh, okay. What do we got? Oh, social. Oh, look at that. Hey, look, I got 6,000 likes for my picture and 787 followers. This is way better than me in real life. Uh, uh, let's see. In Canada, they have national, they have a national park across from the border from here. I'm not calling them copycats, but I'm also not calling them real original. <laughs> Hashtag van life. Hashtag Glacier National Park. Everyone gains comfort. All right. Well, look at that. Rest. We already rested. I feel like I'm out of a lot of stuff. I'm getting low. Uh, getting low on food. My tire situation not good, but I don't have anything here to get. We got to hit the road. I can't hang out in glaciers all day. We got to go to Aaron. I hate to tell your son, but we're headed to Butt. Butt, Montana. Well, it might be Butte, but it might be Butt. When we get to Butte, Montana, we're going to break out a snack that I was mailed by not one, but two of the largest sponsors that have ever sponsored this show. Need some teepee for my butte. Uh, it has started raining, forcing you to slow down. This van don't slow for rain, so I don't know what it's talking about. Although it might wipe off the three layers of paint I've put on. Oh, look, it's raining. That's cute. Cameron felt loved and respected. <laughs> Not this van, baby. <laughs> they were all telling about his poor broken arm. Cameron gains comfort. Well, good for you, Cameron. That's good. I mean, Cameron Cameron and Kelly have been nothing but trouble on this drive. Oh, my gosh. Um, all right, so we're going to take a break here for just a second. And um, again, if you missed the very beginning of the show, uh, I, I was talking about all the different van life channels that I follow. And one of the van life channels that I follow on YouTube is uh, Getter Better, uh, who had a contest where you could mail in a funny video or something. And if you mailed in a video uh, and they picked you as a winner, you got to win a prize. And so I won a Getter Better. This is an official van life hat, uh, which we're wearing on our van life adventure. So I uh, reached out to some very large companies this week. I told them, I said, I'm going uh, on a van life adventure for, uh, for my stream. And I'm going to need some supplies. I'm going to need some drinks. I'm going to need some snacks. Those are really the two most important things that we've seen on this uh, uh, <clears throat> van life adventure. Tires, not that important. First aid, eh. Take it or leave it. Gas, don't need it. What do we need? We need drinks and we need snacks. And so I reached out to two very, very large companies. 
I sent an email to Pepsi and I said, Pepsi, I would like you to sponsor my video, but I also needed some snacks <clears throat> and I reached out to the best snack in the world, the maker of peeps. So I said, Pepsi, I need some drinks for my van life trip peeps. I need some snacks for my van life trip. And you know what those two companies said? Radio silence, not a word from either one of them. But my wife did hear my cries and she went to the store and came out with this. It is peeps flavored Pepsi. I've heard about this. Um, I've seen online people talking about this, but I have not tried it yet. <clears throat> it is literally says peeps. I'm going to show you this one more time here. Uh, there's a peep at the top. Uh, Pepsi times peeps. Artificial marshmallow flavored cola. Huh. It tastes like flat Pepsi. <laughs> That's what it tastes like. I don't taste marshmallow in it at all. Um, well, everything needs rum. I mean, there might be just a slight sweet aftertaste that is supposed to be the, the marshmallow. Like literally, if you, if you told me that they just took the Pepsi that had gone bad from last year and put it in new cans, I'd, I'd believe it. Now, the reason that you said uh, only a hundred calories, uh, it might be deceiving, uh, but this is a can, a regular can of Diet Dr. Pepper. So uh, it's not that it's uh, less calories. Uh, it's just less content. <laughs> it's, it's a a smaller, uh, uh, smaller can. This is a, a normal can of soda is 12 ounces. And um, I'm guessing this is an eight ounce. Uh, 7.5 ounce. Um, and the Diet Dr. Pepper has um, zero calories. Calories, zero. This, uh, I'm not, not, not vibing on it. I think we'll stick to it. Now, what I was afraid of, if you watched uh, this morning's episode of Rando Rob, uh, my dad came over last weekend and brought me this can of Coke, uh, which, as you can see at the top, is shaped a little bit differently than modern cans of soda. It doesn't have that tapered uh, look. And uh, this can of soda is from the uh, 1982 World's Fair. And I said, where did you find that? And he said, in my cupboard. <laughs> and I said, so like a secret cupboard somewhere? He says, no, just the cupboard in his kitchen where he keeps stuff. So my dad was cleaning out his cupboard and found a 41-year-old can of soda <laughs> in the back of his, of his uh, uh, cupboard. I think stuff must have got moved around uh, during a cleaning or something. 
I don't think it sat in there for 41 years, but, uh, uh, hokey dokey, man, my stomach. I'm not one of those guys with a, um, uh, weak stomach, but, uh, that's weird. That's a, it's, it's got a kind of a, it's not a marshmallow aftertaste. It's a something taste. It could be laxative. The peeps will be making me go to sleeps. Okay, did we already rest? No, we just got here. We haven't rested. I got, I got, I'm worried about Kelly. Come on, Kelly. Uh, Crazy Ken, all right. Hey, did you know the government sprays chemicals in the sky? They're trying to mind control all of us. Uh, are you okay? Uh, what happened? What was that about? The crazy can encounter <laughs> made everyone laugh. Everyone gains comfort. I don't think I would feel comfort if a random guy came up and started talking about chemtrails. At least he's gone. Uh, Kelly, man, I'm, I'm real worried about Kelly. I'm going to let him rest one more time. Let's see if I can rest without uh, a visit from Crazy Ken. That'd be nice. While they're resting. Uh-oh. Someone's out of food. All right. <clears throat> so... Uh, I think we're going to have to go. Yeah, that's a, a problem. How much money do I have? I got 94 bucks. Let's buy 50 food now. And then, um, we're going to do some challenges and earn some money. And then I'll buy some more food. All right. What do we got today? <clears throat> the spiral game. Okay. Race up the hill. I won the spiral game last time. I get $45 and three gallons of gas, and I get this stupid paint paint job. Okay, let's put my mouse in the center of the mouse pad here. Okay. All right. Let me have it. Oh, now we're going the other way. Okay. Oh, giant boulder. A giant car. Okay, okay, okay. There's some... It's like the uh, gas bubble. Oh! Ah! Ah! Okay, okay. And then, oh, boy. Oh, no, no. No, Mishima. It's like the gas thing's from... Oh, oh, no! Okay, stay on your side of the road. Why am I on the wrong side of the road? Why are they on the wrong side of the road? It's like uh, road blasters getting the... Ah! No! Oh! Ah, oh, no! Boulder! Oh, no, the oh, I took a hit from the boulder. Okay, give me the gas. Give me my bubbles. Oh. Did I... I don't know that I did as good that time. Oops, I clicked off the... My mouse pointer is two monitors away. That's how crazy I was driving just now. Uh, okay, what did I get? I got the money. I got three gallons of gas. Uh, okay. And I got the paint. I don't love that paint color. Okay. Uh, but I got some money. Let's go back to um, the shop. Let's get some more food while I can. Uh, one food. I don't want 50. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's see what's our other. Let's get back into town. Oh, my gosh. Uh, what's our other task here? Oh, draw your own wheels and race. Draw new wheels if you get stuck. Do you guys have any idea? What kind of wheel would I draw to get up that ramp? Like completely round? Maybe the most round wheel would get me up it? Oh, I see what he did there. Okay, I'm drawing a round wheel first. Okay, that's a round wheel. Yeah, no problem. Oh, look at that. Come on, okay. Look. 
Oh, okay. I'm going to draw what he drew. <laughs> oh, get through there. Get through there. Come on. That's a pretty good looking wheel. I'm sticking with that for now. Oh, I need something faster. Oh, that'll get me up those stairs. Oh, yeah. Yeah, come on. Keep going. Oh, I'm racing that other guy. You see him? Oh, no! Am I winning? Okay, now, now go. Give me a round wheel. Go. Oh. Oh, I gotta make that same shape. Oh, he beat me to the end. And also, my engine's on fire. Oh, Jesus. But you know what? 42 bucks, really. I feel like, uh, what did I get? Uh, oh, look at this decal I got. Oh, we're putting that on the van right now. Go to the garage. Oh, I forgot about all this stuff. Uh, give me that. Where's that decal? I heart New York. I don't want that crap. Give me my sweet. There we go. Look at this. Nothing says a bunch of cool dudes hanging out in a van. <laughs> a giant purple van with a rainbow stripes on it. <laughs> oh, I bet that that's improved uh, Kelly's mood there. All right, let's. Uh, I don't need to rest anymore. There's no tasks. I already did all the tasks. Let's see if there's anybody to trade. There's nothing here. No one wants to trade with me. This is available task, but there's okay. Uh, shop. What do I need? A little bit more food. Yeah, I need some more food. Oh gosh, I need tires. This place got tires. Uh, yeah, I need some tires, bro. All right, tires. Okay. Oh no, I just oh I just spent all my money on tires. Toolkit. Nope. Put a little gas in. And I put a thousand miles on this piece of crap van. All right, let's get out of here. All right, where are we going? Yeah, the van, I mean, the van has issues. There's no lying about that. All right, I'll let you guys choose. Do we want to go to Bismarck or do we want to go to Yellowstone? I bet Yellowstone, I take some great pictures, but Bismarck, I don't know. Oh, but look, we'll be right by um, uh, South Dakota. Look right there. We're right by, uh, I, I've actually uh, been right there. I've been right here where you don't have to pay entrance and I'm taking pictures from the closest spot you could get to Mount Rushmore without paying the entrance fee. So I've been like right that, uh, well, I guess you can't see my, my cursor, but uh, you know what? Uh, hold on for a second. I don't know that it makes so much of a difference, but <clears throat> um, castle game. Um, Where's uh, Steam Properties Capture Cursor? There we go. <clears throat> uh, so anyway, I, yeah, I've been uh, right there. That's about where you can get uh, where it's free. Um. All right. Well. I think we shall go to, let's go to, oops, I think we'll go to Yellowstone. <clears throat> 4 a.m., good time to leave on a road trip. While we're driving, I'll have some more of this Pepsi Peep flavor. <sighs> You're passing by a gas station. Do you stop? Why not? 
whatever. I mean, I don't know how many horror movies you've seen, but nothing ever happens with a van full of teenagers stopping at a random gas station at four in the morning. <clears throat> oh, I can buy food. Gas is pretty cheap here. Uh, fuel, what kind of food do we have? <clears throat> That's not really a good deal. I mean, all right. Nothing but us dudes in this giant purple van. <clears throat> I don't know at Bismarck if they do. You spend an hour driving around lost. You hit a large pothole. All right, so this is starting to repeat. We've seen a lot of these. Uh, I lose one of my repair things. My wheels don't sound so good. Or maybe that's my engine. Uh, <clears throat> all right. So what we learned before is that we're supposed to read this. <laughs> There's 2 million acres. Uh, it's the northwest corner of the state of Wyoming. Uh, Ferdinand Hayden. That seems like it might be the answer to a question. Um, Yellowstone National Park covers two over 2 million. Okay. Uh, what am I? Oh, oh boy. Okay, yeah, I'm not doing all that. All right. <laughs> this is a very, this would be a good game if you actually wanted to read um, and learn these things. Uh, but I don't. Oh, and so now it's the quiz. Yeah, you guys, oh wait, let's go to social. I'm going to take some pictures here, try to get some more. Oh, look at that. Got another 1,500 followers. <laughs> I bet I'll get 1,500 followers just from this video alone, from tonight's stream. I'll probably lose about seven, would be my guess. Uh, all right, let's try this quiz. Can somebody, somebody's going to help me guess these answers. What mammal has its, that's not the right way to do its, it's not it is, has its largest wild herd in Yellowstone National Park. I know there are always bison herds. I'm going with bison. And I am correct. Oh, oh. Every time I get one wrong, I have to have a drink of peat flavored Pepsi. Uh, Yellowstone National Park was the first one of what in the United States? Was it the first national park? The first protected land, first preservation site, or the first national monument. Yeah, I feel like it's a national park when we're talking about national parks. I'm going national park. Yes. Two for two. We got to do, we got to get one of the next two right. What is the name of the most famous geyser in Yellowstone National Park? What a gimme because uh, I've been there. And I'll tell you my old faithful story. My wife and I and two young kids, everybody was super tired on our road trip. We went to Yellowstone. Nobody wanted to see Old Faithful. They said Old Faithful erupts, I think, roughly once every hour and a half, like every 90 minutes, something like that. Uh, the kids were fussing. Nobody wanted to do it. And we walked up to Old Faithful. I literally got out of the car, walked up, and I said, hey, how long? And it erupted. And we stood there for three minutes and then it quit. And then we go, get in the car. So we waited five seconds to watch. <laughs> that was good Irish timing. Uh, and so Old Faithful is the answer. If we could go four out of four, I'll chug this can. Uh, but if I get it wrong, I said I'd have a drink too. So I'm losing either way. What state contains the majority of Yellowstone National Park? Well, didn't it say... That we were in Wyoming. I know it's not Texas. I know it's not California. And I'm pretty sure it's not Colorado. You answered every question correctly. You are a van life star.
Oh, God, it's terrible. Pepsi Peep. It stores now. Yellowstone National Park, we get $112, boom, we get 30 food, pow, repair kit, yes, four gallons of gas, yes, this is the best thing anybody's ever got from Yellowstone National Park. You know what? Have a little rest, Kelly, you've earned it, buddy. You've earned some rest. While everyone was out for bathroom break, a thief breaks into your stupid ass van and stole forty-one dollars. Thanks, Yellowstone. I appreciate you. I appreciate that. Uh, let's see. What's our gas look like? How much is the gas? Oh, who's this? Whoa, whoa, Windsor. Are you an angel? Cause that van looks like it fell straight out of heaven. So sweet. That's what I thought. Um, we did our social thing. We did our quiz. We've rested. Let's hit the road, baby. That's what van life is. Uh, oh, so I went to... Oh, I went to Butte. Then I went to Yellowstone. Well, let's continue our trip down here. we got one or two more stops on this van. And then the van's going to have to sail on. Let's go to Salt Lake City. Never actually been to Salt Lake City. I've been to Utah, but I've never been to Salt Lake City. Cameron tried to take a nap, but couldn't. He's tired and grumpy. I got... Have you noticed that three of my five people have never complained about anything? Three of the five are great. Kelly and Cameron... Jamie and Tyler are arguing about colors. What if, like, my blue... Can I scroll this down? Oh, there we go. Is your red? What if C-A-T really spelled dog? I think as, as the trip goes on, they're getting along less. Uh, you see a box and nothing bad ever happens from looking inside a box. It's always been money. We found money, money inside every box. At some point, we're going to find a human head. But until that happens, we're going to keep looking at boxes. 46 food. And let me tell you, if, the, if there's any kind of food that I like, it's random food found in a box on the side of the interstate in the middle of the night. Mmm. That's van life, baby. Uh, I mean, oh, oh, wait a minute. This looks bad. Oh, I thought I was about to get like one of those uh, insurance guys. This guy's going to rear end my car and then they're going to do an insurance claim. <laughs> it's just a traffic jam. Uh, I'll just be patient. Sometimes at 2 a.m. on your way in Salt Lake City, there's traffic jams. Although, like a real traffic jam, I just have to keep waiting and clicking a button here. There we go. That wasn't so bad. I mean, I'm telling you right now, Curtis, I would take six-hour old coffee over a can of peat-flavored Pepsi any day. Any day. Oh, Cameron, your broken arm healed just in time for your allergies. You know what? Suffer. I'm sick of you, dude. Kelly didn't hit a squirrel. <laughs> there we go. Well, it's not a raccoon. We got a squirrel. Uh, and saw it running off into the trees. That's good. I got to tell you, when I'm done streaming, I'm going to be playing this. Tw this is my only game that I'm going to play from now on. Uh, there's no time for... You know what? There is time to rest. Let's give everybody some rest real quick. Nobody robbed my van. Cameron's allergies heal. Okay, great. Get some rest. 
Finish a rest. Oh, it's Crazy Karen. What a fun surprise. Hey, be careful driving that van. I watched a video that proved the world is flat. <laughs> if you aren't careful, I guess I'm supposed to scroll down here. You'll drive off the edge, which is kind of funny. It's supposed to be funny, except for I played a mini game earlier where I literally drove off the edge of, of something. So um, should I say you're crazy or leave us alone? What's the difference? Leave us alone, crazy Karen. What was all that about? Uh, made everybody laugh and we get some comfort. I don't care about comfort. This is all I care about. New tasks. Smash through obstacles and get some... Okay, this one. Okay, I'm ready for this one now. Okay, get the mouse pad ready. Get the mouse ready. Now I know how to drive the van. Okay, here we go. You gotta go for the low numbers. Five, oh, 11, uh, 13, five... Uh, seven, get the diamond. Oh, go around that one. Uh, that's low enough. That's low. That's low. Oh, hit the middle. Oh, this is, this is the easiest one. I'm pretty good at this one. Uh, oh, I'm terrible at that. I'm really bad at this one. Okay, give me a diamond. Give me a diamond. Diamond, low. Uh, take a four. Twenty and nine. Look at that. I got the diamonds. That's how you do van life, baby. That is exactly like what it's like when I drive to work. Whew. Okay. Uh, what did I get? $132. All right. Uh, we might be painting this uh, van just so crazy Karen don't see me. What else we got here? Um, use your, this is a new one. Use your giant magnet. To collect all the cubes before time runs out. And, oh, I'd get a new color. I like that gray. This is going to make it look like an undercover uh, AT&T van. All right, what do we got to do here? Huh. What am I doing here? Oh. Okay. Don't drive off. Come over here, dude. All right, that wasn't too bad. Oh. Come on, get over here. Oops, I clicked off the thing. Okay. Oh, look how close I was. All right, what did I win? 30 bucks and a tire, which is kind of like what you would win at a, a contest at Sanford and Sons. Elizabeth, get him $30 and a tire. <laughs> um, but I did get that sweet paint job. Let's go to the shop. Let's slap on that coat of paint, baby. Um, oh, it's not the shop. I need to go to the garage. Uh, where's some paint? Can I get that decal off? Yeah, there we go. Let's take that decal off. Let's go get my gray paint I just bought. Or a one. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. Repair my engine. My engine is almost dead. All right. Uh, how much money? Might as well buy a toolkit. Okay. Okay. Let's go back into town. Oh, I better get some. Let's see what we got here. Food's getting low, but everything else is great. Let's buy some food. I hope everybody else is having fun because I'm enjoying this game. <laughs> this is my kind of game. <laughs> uh, buy food. Buy 88 food? Why not? When you're a rich van life guy like me, I could just throw the money around, load this thing with food. Uh, 
Uh, am I having to drive in every day? Oh, and like real life at work? No, I don't go in at all. Uh, nope, I work from this chair right here, but I turn 90 degrees and my work computer is over there. Oh yeah, fuel is good. Uh, well, it was, why not? I got the money. I'm van life rich. All right. Where am I now? Salt Lake City. Oh, man, Las Vegas. I bet this is going to have some... I want some good minivan or good mini games in Las Vegas. Let's head on over there. Oh, I should have got a toolkit. I thought I loaded up on toolkits. Uh, it has started raining, forcing me to slow down. Mostly because I've got wet paint on this van. Uh... You spent an hour lost. I was driving slow. How did I get lost? Maybe the rain confused me. Maybe Cameron was driving with his broken arm. And Kelly, they were fighting about colors. Uh, you see a car stopped on the side of the road. Of course, we'll stop. It was probably full of money. I don't know how it happened, but I ran out of gas again. Seems to happen to me a lot, actually. Can you spare a gallon? Well, they're going to give me something. Uh... Yeah, $146. Gallon was $2, so I gave him $2 worth of gas. She gave me $146. Thanks, Dana. There is no Dana. There's only Zool. Uh, Cameron can't get cell phone reception. God dang this guy. I picked the wrong guy, man. Yeah, it is a little bit like Jones in the Fast Lane. I popped a tire. Replace tire. That's the easiest tire replacement I've ever had. Uh, you see a bag laying out, and that can only mean one thing. Money, 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 money. <sighs> Just when you get your hopes up. Oh, no. Oh, no. The popo got us. Oh, no. Police car is pulling you over. Shoot. Fire. Fire. Oh, wait. I have seen. Oh, have you seen a German Shepherd running around here? I lost my canine unit after he ran after a squirrel. If you could pay a little fine, I could go to the pet store and get a replacement. The chief will never notice. I'm going to fake cry. I'll be honest. I'm a little jealous of you. You get to drive around seeing cool places while I'm stuck pulling cars over. This feels like a personal vendetta, the guy that wrote this game. Don't worry about the fine. I have to rethink my life. <laughs> That's every time I've ever been pulled over. That's exactly how it went. That was odd. Uh, you are passing by a gas station. Uh, I don't think I need anything. That was weird. Was that? Oh, no. Traffic jam. Traffic jam. I mean, we're going to Las Vegas. Now I can believe that. That looked like the line when I went to In-N-Out Burger in Vegas. Welcome to Las Vegas. That looks just like Las Vegas, too. With its um, buildings and tree and bench. The bumper game. Now, I failed the bumper game terribly last time. But this time... I will not. I will not. Nope, I will not. Oop, I clicked outside the... the uh, nope. 
No. No. I won $50 for that great performance. You've unlocked a new customization. Oh, look at those decals. Um, what do we got here? Draw your own wheels and race. I mean, I didn't see any reason not to just draw that one wheel that it drew. Did you see any reason to not do that? I mean, which looks a lot like his wheel. I'm just going to let it play out here. Oh, my wheels are stuck a little bit. Can I... I'm like a, like a roly-poly stuck on a bump here. I don't know how to win. I mean, I don't know how to make my guy go faster. Kind of winning. It's neck and neck. I just don't want to mess with my wheels at this point. I'm just not going to mess with it. I want to draw the... You think? Oh, but then while I was drawing, I wasn't going. Oh, I messed it up. It was a good idea. I screwed it up. While I was drawing, I had no wheels. Yeah, I messed it up. My shields are good. Yeah, 42 bucks. I'll take that. Let's go look and see what we need here. Uh, Probably use some food. Uh, that's fine. What else? First aid, I'm good. Tires, I'm good. Oh, I got no toolkits. Oh, boy. Uh, where is that? Here? Oh, no. That's not where you buy them. Where do you buy the toolkits? Is that here? Or is that in the shop? Supply shop? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Toolkits. All right. Uh, okay, what do we got? Let's take a look at our gas. Whoa, what's our gas? Oh, boy. Cutting it close. The soothing sounds of Las Vegas. Welcome to KLAS. Have we ever got that to work? I don't think we've ever traded with anybody. Can I? I didn't know I could click these guys. I guess they would have they would have been offering me uh it's weird as much time as we spend in the van the van only ever touches the road can't we hit another car <laughs> just a little it's got to be lonely being a vehicle well, that's weird if anyone feels sick just take a handful of medicine we definitely have enough to pass it out by the handful now and if one will do the trick, then a hand fill will make you super healthy. Good advice. All right. Let's go to one more city. Yeah, there's some good bad advice there. Oh, did we go to Hollywood? Yeah, we started in... Oh, no, we started up in Portland, right? We're going to end our trip in Los Angeles. It's going to be our last stop here. It is weird. It, there's definitely some weird stuff. Uh, he caught the dreaded common cold. Uh, does he need one? Uh, suffer. That guy deserves just pain and suffering. <clears throat> As does Kelly. <sighs> I should not have picked this guy. He just fights with everybody. Large pothole. Good timing. A tire flew out the window. 
I mean, the visual of that happening is kind of weird. Welcome to L.A. It looks just like it. It looks more like L.A. than the other one looked like Vegas. I'll say that. What have we got here? Uh, the Spiral Game. All right. We know how to do this one. Luke, if you're still there, wish me luck, brother. Tell me left or right. Tell me left or right, Luke. It's right, 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 right. Oh, it's left. It's left. Oh, it's right. Cause that dude's stressing me out. This honking. Oh, I missed all that. Get this. Okay, that. Oh, I missed. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Boulder. Oh boy. Okay, let's get all those. Oh. I was hugging his shoulder. Watch out for the log. I don't know why there's a giant. Oh, yep, yep, yep. My bad. My bad. Okay, boulder. Oh, inside. Outside. Oh, giant log. Inside. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Well, that's the better place to be. I tell you, the bad place to be is in my van. Oh. Yeah, that was Dead Man's Curve, I think. Uh... $91 and first aid. Now, I don't know how to necessarily save my game. Maybe it automatically saves when I close it out. We'll find out. Uh, I unlocked uh, that sweet purple color again. Um, and let's see. Let's see other. Uh, bounce your opponents. Oh, it's the arena one again. I got to figure out how to do this one better. I kind of see. Um, <laughs> my goal was to let everybody hit in the middle and stay away from that. But um, as it turns out, that did not work. Although that performance was somehow worth $55 and. Ooh, a new customer. Look at that. That's a, that's some sweet decals. Uh. Let's go to the garage. When I get my real van all done, I'm going right to the decal store. And I'm putting on uh, this sweet <laughs> graphic of the Rocky Mountains right there on the van. That's nice. What upgrades? Let's see. How's my engine? Um... My engine could be at 125, but I don't have any money. Uh, I don't have money for that. Um, this is more like real van life. I don't have money for any of these things that I need. Uh, okay. That's good on all that. Congratulations. Food is there. First aid, five out of four. Tires, I could probably use some tires. Since I had one fly out the window. And, uh, we did our challenges. I mean, the van's ready to go and we're in LA and LA is a cool place to crash, man. There's going to go see some, there's going to be some, uh, bands down on, uh, sunset strip. Uh, Gonna go tour Capitol Records, go to that famous uh, cemetery that's in uh, LA. Got lots of stuff to do on vacation in LA. Might even go to the beach. So, this is a good place to stop and park our van. Um, so, let's take a look here. I mean, do you see any way to close it other than just this X out button? I don't wanna lose my prog progress here. Uh, I'll give you that. I will give you that. It's all about the van life. That's, um, so that's my goal, uh, in the next month or so is to get the van ready where I can go around. I'm going to get my, some friends, hopefully ones whose arms don't break, uh, when we're driving in the van or lose cell phone reception or, I uh, have to go to the bathroom and their their stupid happiness thing is going down. It costs me money. Hopefully my tires don't fly out my windows. 
what a terrible tragedy that is. Um, so, um, absolutely. I mean, that's the goal. Uh, you know, the goal in this game is, um, uh, the goal is to go to national parks and in between national parks, check out random boxes on the side of the road. But I feel like in my world, those goals may be flipped. I'm just going to drive to random boxes that I see on the side of the road. And if I happen to pass a national park, I might swing in and look at one, but really the goal Really, I'm just all about finding that money in bags. That's like my new, that's my new jam right there. So, um, yeah, you know, I mean, if you're, if you're in a van with two people and they get so depressed because they're arguing about the chicken and the egg, then you go, listen, let me tell you how it works. Let's go stop over at this rest stop. You guys go way over there and I'll tell you a secret. And then when they get way over there, you start the van and you leave. That's what happened to Joe Dirt. That's what happens to Cameron and people in my van arguing and stuff like that. So, well, that was an interesting little game. Uh, five bucks on Steam. Again, I was kind of searching for, um, you know, a retro game or something that had uh, vans in it or whatever. And, and I was on Google and that came up and I thought, well, what what better game for me than a, a van life? It even had hashtag van life. I was getting followers in the game, more followers than I have in real life. That's for sure. So. Um, anyway, uh, let's see where are we at in the world. Uh, two days ago, we released a new episode of throwback reviews. Is that right? Or yesterday, I guess yesterday, what is today? The first, yeah, yesterday, there's a new episode of throwback reviews on throwback reviews. We went through and talked about some of our favorite films from 1981 uh, so there's some good stuff in there. And then uh, late last night, early this morning, there's a new episode of You Don't Know Flack Out in which I talk all about my memories and history with uh, Weird Al. And so, and then we will have a new Sprite Castle probably uh, either tomorrow, probably more likely Friday. Um, and uh, that will be covering Zaxxon. So, um uh, lots of fun stuff, lots of fun stuff going on. And, uh, none of that, there will be no more podcasts for the next six months because I'll only be playing this game. I will only be driving around in my virtual van. <laughs> just me and Cameron and people with uh, broken arms, uh, and just drive around. So I see Steve saying that uh, there might be storms in his area. So everybody, if you're in a storm area, everybody stay safe. And, um, with that, I'm out of here. So. Thanks for uh, dropping in, everybody, and uh, I will see you guys all next Wednesday. Take care.